So like. let's talk about what you care about today. Yes, okay, so I know we're at the start of summer. Maybe you're going on vacation, maybe you're not. Maybe you have some unexpected bills because you have to send your kids to camp in the summer or whatever yeah, you do. do. So we're gonna share some ways how to save money. Oh, I love that. Okay, this okay. is good. So this sure. article, Lance found, I love it. And the first one, you never have to pay full price for anything. So then the article lists like all of the ways that you don't have to pay full, full price. So for food, for tickets, you can usually find a discount. Um, for sure. Um, what's I'm discount code, code, a coupon? Yes, code. Okay, what's online. The word? Code like, online. Sounds like, yes. But th in this article too, it mentioned a couple of times about just asking to get things cheaper. Like, is wow. this fruit old? Can I get it for half price? And usually you can work out a deal. Come now, on. I'm not really gonna go and like haggle <laughs> in my local Kroger, but <laughs> if you are so inclined to do that, go they, you, for they'll it. take you up on it. Yeah. You Why could get, not? You could get a discount. It doesn't mm -hmm. hurt to mm -hmm. ask. It's true. Right? It's true. Okay. Um, the next one is upgrade to an older phone. Okay? Now, you don't always need the newest, shiniest phone with all the bells and whistles. Now, no, I have a true. very good girlfriend who gives me all of her old phones. So I have not bought an iPhone since wow. they first came out. That's yeah. really sweet. And so she'll send it to me. Now, I will say I never changed a SIM card, and so I recently had to get a new one because it was, like, operating in, like, 1999. Right. But uh, <laughs> so you got to keep up with that. But, I mean, it's okay to borrow. I mean, I have no shame in it. Yeah. She's like, do you want my old phone? I'm like, absolutely. Absolutely, Send yes. it on over. And I never get the newest and latest and greatest. I because mm -hmm. inevitably it's going to be bells and whistles that need to be worked right. out sometimes. Right. So I just always get a generation mm -hmm. or two mm -hmm. behind. Mm -hmm. Now listen, I because I'm a true journalist, I called AT&T and I said, can you like get a discount right now on the carrier? If I, and they said, just be careful if you're in a grandfathered plan. So ask, like if you've had AT&T service for 15 years, yeah. you probably have a deal that you can't get again. So don't get out of that deal. Got it. But if you threaten to like switch a carrier, like I'm going to Sprint or Verizon, Ooh. they will usually give you a discount on your plan and on your phone. That's great. Yeah. So Good information. Know. Look Try at you that. digging around. <laughs> Try Love that. it. See if it works. Love Tell my I sent it. Yeah. Um, okay. The next one is invest in a health savings account. Now, I never do this one because mm. I'm not an employee with benefits. <laughs> yeah. But if I was, yes. this We're really saves you a lot. This yes. really saves you a lot of money. And I know friends that have paid for LASIK with it. But, okay, here's the kicker on this. Not only <laughs> using tax-free money, but you can you need to check with your individual um, plan and you can buy things like over the counter stuff too at the drugstore. Oh. Yeah. So it doesn't have to be for things you, that you would typically associate with using your health, health savings account plan right. for. And I think it's one of those things that just the thought of it, mm -hmm. I mean, I'm not going to lie. I kind of glazed over when you start talking about the health plan. Yes. I'm kidding. But yeah, yeah sometimes no, no, you're true. like, what? Mm -hmm. Like thinking of wading through all that material, but it's so important to know what your benefits are and what you can get. Yeah, yeah, like pregnancy tests. Yeah, who knew? Covered by HSA, just I saying. I have no all idea. All right, and those are expensive. They are, they are yeah. expensive. Yeah, when I was like 50 a day, just <laughs> kidding, I never did that. Not that crazy. Okay, <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, let's keep it real. Okay. okay, for parents, set up a 529, so this is an education plan yeah. for your child. Fun fact about Georgia is that in Georgia, you can use any state's 529 plan. So some oh. states have it, so you have to have that plan. But not Georgia, you can use anybody's plan. Oh, wow. And Great. some of them have better incentives than of others. Course. So check that out or ask your bank or your financial planner. Okay. That was the one thing I learned when I took um, financial planning class. That was it. Mm -hmm. Well, that's good for you to, yeah. for doing that. Well, I, it's fine. Um, <laughs> I'm not sure, I'm not sure I learned like a lot, sure, right. but um, I, you know what I learned in the, my financial planning class? You have to get a financial planner. That's uh, what I learned. There you go. <laughs> it's too hard. That, to right. Yourself. You're like, I can't, I can't answer <laughs> yes, this. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. okay. Um, upgrade your accounts to a family plan. So that was on the list a couple couple times with like Netflix, Hulu, and also your cell phone plans. And this was the fun takeaway fact from this factoid was that you don't have to necessarily be a family. Did you know that? No. Yeah. So you could go in with like four of your friends, designate the res most responsible <laughs> yes, please to do. pay the bill. Right. But you don't have to be like a blood member. Like it's not like family is family. a loose term. That's yeah. See, all mm -hmm. of these things. I like that. We're trying okay. to save you money here, people. We we'll are. put up the complete yeah. list yes. on our Facebook page. Mm -hmm.